previously on Hardline. So some real deal shit is going down. There's someone you need to talk to. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? You're about the only one we can trust. Who could possibly be in it for me? Dawes needs to know there are consequences for what he's done. Is it really that tough a choice? I'm Julian Dawes, and they say I cleaned up Miami. Yes, I've cleared the decks of a few bad apples, but I had a lot of help. Now, I've been a police officer my entire adult life. And as much as it pains me to admit it, I've come to realize that the way we do police work, especially drug enforcement, is dangerously outdated. With your investment, together we can forge the new future of law enforcement. Our old captain's been busy. Jeez. Cleaned up Miami? Get this. They're calling Dawes America's police chief. Where the hell is that from, anyway? An angel investor pitch video. You ever heard of preferred outcomes? No. Well, you will. Dawes thinks privatized law enforcement is the future. Preferred outcomes is his way of cornering the market. <laughs> I changed my mind. Take me back to prison. Maybe later. First this. Car dealership? Nope. Korean mafia front, and Dawes is involved. I assume you have proof of that? No, but we've got a guy on the inside. His name's Boomer. He's kind of a freelance IT guy for scumbags. You two will pick him up near the dealership. He'll have all the information we need to take Dawes down. Remind me again why I should trust you? Because you're the only one who hates Dawes more than I do. Guy Boomer's an hour late, Kai. He's not picking up. That means something's wrong. Without him, we get no info on Dawes. Well, not necessarily. You want us to break in? Is anyone still inside? Call my wife till I be late. Can you do that without fucking it up? They're out. Then, yeah, I think you need to break in. Look, they've got to have sales records, bio info, credit ratings, I don't know. Everything I've learned about this place is rotten. You just need to find that computer. The thumb drive should be able to crack the password and get the files. In and out, simple. Right? Definitely would not buy a car from that dude. And Nick, keep an eye out for Boomer, okay? He's a good kid. We'll do what we can. So what, we're babysitters now? Just park near the dealership. Someplace dark. You know, I haven't actually robbed a place in probably 20 years. Huh. Don't worry. Here's just like riding a bike. Who 
puts a car dealership all the way out here? Someone who doesn't give a shit about selling cars. It's online, it's not the one we're looking for. Hey, over by the computer. Is that a letter? It's this one. All right, Kai. This better work. Well, shit. You must have tripped the silent alarm. Yeah. And those are cops. They're coming in. Hey, did you look over there? Go to look around. Someone's here. Find him. Hey, over here. I'm going this way. Tyson, we're about to get a second helping. So, you enjoying your first day as a free man? Between prison and this, I'll take this. Here they come! Who is this guy? Nice work, Mendoza. Yeah, you learn a couple useful things as a cop. <laughs> Speaking of which, your old pals are on their way. Shit. Simple, she said. In and out, she said. Heads up!
Let's get out of here. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Take the riverbed. Jesus Christ, that was nuts! Kai, we got the files. Heading back now. Not yet. We still need to find Boomer. Are you fucking kidding me? He was working at Kang's scrapyard. It's nearby. I can't decrypt those files without him. Kai, these dealership guys? They're still after us. Look, you want to hurt Dawes? This is step one. Got it? Yeah. Got it. We'll be in touch. Gotta get away.